gorgeous and gory. There we go, people. Hold on a second. Wait, wait. Did you hit the record button? I did. Okay, just see how many fragments you have. So, currently, I'm going to be breeding Chompa. I have 7,464 eggs. Not a whole lot. Not a whole lot. It's very little, actually. And I have 442 fragments. So, I am hoping I have enough to do this. Um, <laughs> what do you think? How many fragments do you have? 442. Uh, well, one tenth, you're a little bit short, you're about, yeah, one tenth short, so if she takes 12,000, that'll be 12,500 eggs. That's what you're off by. I'm off by 12,000 eggs? No, no, you're 12, you need 12,500 eggs more, but you have 7,000, so it'll be about 5,000 eggs short. However, if you get prizes and you can open up some chests, you might get the 5,000 eggs that you're short by. Mm -hmm. And so the point of breeding out Champa is so that I have Champa and Kagarnas to get Miatan and Miatan and Anapa get me Zaru, which Somatron just got. Yes, uh, Snow he, Monkey. Snow Monkey. And when he bought when he got the Snow Monkey, he won 22 prizes in the prize tree for the breeding competition um, by using what, 80,000 eggs? No, no, I, yeah, I had used 80,000 eggs. eggs. I had and how many fragments? I had, I had 315,000, I had 315 fragments, and I had used 80,000 eggs to get 385 of his mm -hmm. other fragments via eggs. So, if you, I actually saved 58,000 eggs towards breeding my next garnet. Very good. All right, so I'm going to start recording. I didn't know you had your phone on over there. I was wondering where the hell mine was. Boy, I'm really out of it. Yeah, <laughs> so I'm recording now on the phone so you can see what I'm doing here. Should I be driving while we're doing this? Yeah, that's the point. This it's is almost going to be like one of those reality porno sites where like funky stuff is going on in a car while we're driving. We're breeding dragons. Yeah, and that's right. You know, if you ever rent a car and shit, like, don't tell them. You know, they don't have it in the contract. There's no, there's no dragon breeding in the fucking car. Right. There's no dragon breeding. There's no dragon breeding. <laughs> but we do this. Because rules are made to be bent. bent. And then broken. Mm. And so to get him, it's Quetz and Calvin to get Champa, correct? Mm-hmm, I believe. Uh, that's the best breeding, right? Quetz and Champa? Um, I have to take a look at my notes. I don't want to give you the wrong answer. What's, yeah, that is the breeding. I mean, if that's the breeding in winter, then yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. Quetz and Kelvin. Yeah, sure. Okay, Quetz and Kelvin is who I'm breeding together to get my Chompa. We're going to auto breed out my um, 7,000 eggs. Boom. And do I have one fragment? Keep driving them. Yeah, yeah. And, you know, I also have. Um, <laughs> I'm also doing. See how many fragments you have at the end of the seven thousand eggs. Yeah, yeah. We'll see indeed if it's the good, if it's the proper breeding. I hope we're getting some. Yeah, Aren't yeah. You? I've gotten ten. Okay. Yeah. So it seems pretty good. In five hundred well, feet, turn left. So since we're driving, I'm also have navigation going on my phone as well. So. <laughs> <laughs> turn left toward West North Avenue, then turn right onto West North Avenue. Yes, because we are going from. St. Uh, Charles, Illinois, where we were at the pipe show, to Chicago, Chicago, Chicago. Illinois, to another hotel. Um, so there Turn we go. Right into West North Avenue. And so this is taking. It's actually doing pretty good. Um, yeah, yeah. I've gone through. I have 27 fragments already. Yes. 29. Nice. Continue on West North Avenue for 11 miles. So. Uh, that was, let's just go breed again. I have like 200 eggs, so I'm going to go through those on the breed agains. And they're just giving me platinums. Not one. Mm -hmm. Being douches. Lots you know. douches. Oh, there we go. There's one. Okay, so that gave me 30 fragments. And I have... Going to my breeding, my incubator. I have 442, so that gives me. 472, you're still 28 fragments short. Short, I'm 28 fragments and short. You're about 5% short, so yeah, you'll need the other 5,000 eggs. All right. So. Well, unless they give you fragments, so you're gonna have to open up some gold chests. Well, let's start putting in fragments so I can get down through the prize tree. I'm actually pretty quick at this. Yes. Um, 
and Trampa is a sorceress, which is nice. She's the fury of the river. Oh, is that her name? Yes, I think so. Oh, I like that. You can think of her as a mega Durga. Oh, that means I can dress her up? You can dress her up, you know, put on a little uh, hat on her and get some armor. Rush. Because a lot of the dragons you can't dress up, even though you buy all the stuff to dress them up. Which is sort of annoying. This is going by pretty quickly. I already have a hundred fragments in. Um, but we're driving down the freeway in the backwoods of Illinois. Illinois. Um, which is in That's why the backwoods. That's why the problems in Illinois. Oh yes. Um, there is a little town around here that I was interested in going to. You know? And yet a third dragon to breed another fourth because yeah. when he appeared it was one out of four. Now there's two out of four. Mentioning a second dragon, there will probably be a third. And dragon of light, dragon yeah. of darkness, dragon of what's... The gray. Yeah, the gray, not the dawn. That's the Which, sun of the morning star. Mm -hmm. Well, the gray is a theme in you know lots of sci-fi and mythology. Even Star Wars is about that, the gray Jedi. Which should probably be what... You know, the last Jedi is leading up to, I think. Do you want to open up the sun one? Yes, sure. Okay, there we go. Jedi dragons. Jedi dragons. <laughs> you know, Jedi and dragons. You know, I'm a bit of a nerd. Only I would know this. Um, so we are at 281 fragments and counting in, uh, which is good. Close the window and there's a truck on my left. Yes, yes. Which is why I wanted the sunroof open. And it also has a nice blue skies. Blue skies are always beautiful. It is a beautiful day. Um, it's been a little bit cold since we got to Chicago. Colder than I was assuming it would be from the weather reports I had been looking at. Um, but we shall see to be warmer today and it looks like it is shaping up to be a pretty nice day. Uh, Alright, I'm going to pause this if I can. Alright, so I did run out of Mystic Fragments and so we are going into the season to see if I want any eggs and see if I can um, get any fragments or anything like that in the chat. around the 20th or so prize. Uh, That'll give you some rupees and eggs too. Yes. Yes. Because I had uh, 6,800 from breeding out the cornice and now that got me eight prizes. So that puts me at 15.4k for this event so far. Um, that's 20th prize, 21st, 22nd, 23rd, 24th, okay, I'm doing good, 25th, yeah, sure. 26th prize, so one more prize to go, which I probably won't get, because you need 4,000 more points to get that, so that's very unlikely, um, they did make the last couple prizes pretty far apart, but I need the sigils, so well worth it to breed out this many dragons. Uh, that also gave me eight gold chests, which I'm going to, let's go into the season real quick. Because I might have a gold chest trifecta, which will be very, very nice because I have to some fragments. 
and this is one way if you are short that you can um, try in your missing gap yes yes my next prize gives me 20 gold chests um, in the prize tree which I have enough sigils for now um, and I did not have enough I'm still not at the uh, sapphire um, above the stone for sage but by the end of this I think I will get there um, which will be very very nice because I really want to get sage all the way up um, but that gave me 28 chests gold chests to open to get um, 30 fragments 28 fragments well, you can actually probably use some of the sigils you want now or you can't that, you can't use them now I use my sigils oh, okay okay and got 20 gold chests cool so yeah now you should be able to get whatever you yeah. need to breathe champa Yes, so I got 1,000 eggs, some more one, sigils, one, yeah. some more sigils, okay, not bad. Uh, 225 sigils, 1,000 eggs, 1,000 eggs. Three points, yeah, yeah so, so you have three points, 3,000. 1,000 eggs, good, so very, very close to the 5,000 I needed. And then I have eight chests that I'm going to open up individually. Uh, meat. 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 38% HP towers. Meat. Crap. Crap. <laughs> uh, 150, 150,000 XP potions. Yeah, we'll help during a breeding event. Another 1,000 eggs. eggs. You're almost there on the eggs. Yes. 225 sigils, a bonus, a bonus, could be good, nope, 4,000 food pack, um, 100,000, uh, uh, 8, 100 XP boosts, and 25 one hour speed ups, so not enough eggs, so I'm going to do a 10 pack of gold chests, boom, yes, that's cost 4,000 rubies, as we all know, and then, got it. I got it because I got a thousand eggs, a thousand eggs. Yeah. Um, and then I also got another 125 sigils, five 300,000 XP posts, uh, 125, uh, uh, 25 one hour speed ups, 25 hour one hour speed ups. So good. it was a good Yeah, yeah. 10 you, got, yeah you got enough for uh, breeding out Champa. Yes. And you also moved up a notch or two in your line for Sage. Yep. So it was not that bad. So the rest of my breeding is going to be with eggs to get Chompa. Um, you want to finish her up in the hotel? You're going to do it now. Might as well just do it now. Okay, go ahead. All right. We can do Aster in the new hotel. Okay. Because he's going to get Aster. Yes, I have over 15,000 sigils for him. Nice. Let's see, so that gave me 12,000, just over 12,000 eggs, and so I should be able to finish breeding him out. No problem, a lot of eggs left over. Yep. Oh, I bet one of those, I was like, how is that 12,000? It's because one of those yeah, was yeah, a 3,000 yeah, instead yeah. of a one. Nice! You wouldn't even have had to open the 10 chest, but it's okay. No, it was in the 10. Oh, yeah, yeah. It was in the 10. It was one of those was a 3,000 one. Well, that's still, it'll come in handy. It wasn't a waste. No. It was not a waste at all. Let's see. That took us from 12,000. We're at 491 now, and I'm at 6,000 eggs. Most. Nice. That's it. Once it breathes, it'll stop. That's it. Breathing. Thank you, babe. Yes. That's it. Yep. Thank you, babe. And he takes 28 days to hatch. We never wait. Um, we wait. No. <laughs> uh, four weeks, just four weeks. Just four weeks. 28 days. That would be like a third of the competition, like the whole season. Well, yeah. Sure. Five multiples. 
and here he is hatching. Here she is hatching. Let's see. I doubt you can see her. But there she is. She's hatching. Gorgeous and gory. Gorgeous and gory. I'll have to go see what I can dress her up in. Uh, she has thunderstorm, which is nice. Nocturnal Fisher, Frozen Tomb, and Trebuchet Resist. They say that she's only good for doing experience bases, but that's not really true. And I always thought it was odd that people said that Durga was a good dragon. Why wouldn't Chompa be a good dragon? She's like a mega Durga. She has all the powers of Durga and then some, and she packs her wallop if you grade her up. So, yeah, she's a fine dragon. And I'm I'm sorry, she has Frozen Tomb, which basically is Freeze with a shield. Yeah, that's what Kelvin has to make him a kick ass dragon over Vulcan. And so. then she actually has Nocturnal Fisher, which is a shield. Yeah. And Thunderstorm. So, I'm not sure why people think she's not a good dragon. I think she's going to be an excellent girl. Uh, she's not the prettiest beast, but that. I like her. And now she's going to her home. And we will see you in Chicago.